Well, hello, guys, and welcome back to another little episode of... That's right, Titania. Spin around. Lobo frames. Is it just me or are we really close to Titania's face? <laughs> Love Warframes! Let's get it right. That was a really mediocre Love Warframes. It was like, oh, welcome back to Love Warframes. God. Anyway, we are back. Back again for another Mastery Rank Up. Why are we so close to Titania's face? If you're wondering why or how I'm Mastery Ranking Up so damn quick, <laughs> it's because I merged my Legendary One account on my Xbox with this account and it's gone cuckoo. It's gone a little bit cray cray. Everything's just gone a little bit mad <laughs> i mean it's nuts um i shall link the merge video if you want to see what happened and what i found <laughs> i'd forgotten a lot of the stuff i had or this honey anyway turns out they've given me like all of the affinity like all of it i had 2.9 mil affinity i think that's in the bank ready to go for the next run the next run the next run the next run i think maybe possibly i'm not sure so this test my darlings i let me show you my uh loadout first what was that on the floor this is my, this is this account, Titania, not my old account, <laughs> my legendary one account, Titania. This one's actually quite good. So this is my loadout for this test. I didn't change anything in the list, this loadout specifically. I, obviously I have steel charge in there, but I'm really, I want full energy when I spawn in. Now, because I have this preparation mod in and that's not, that's not fully uh, fused, this one. I, I get all of my number of the beast, 666 energy, I get all of it, 666.1 energy, and that's because this Titania has Archon Shards, now these Archon Shards are brilliant for this kind of stuff, so you can see I've got 30% maximum energy filled on spawn, and with the 82% preparation mod, basically I've got my full energy when I spawn in which is a freaking awesome for stuff like this so in this test you do have to go and collect these little orbs there's blue ones and red ones red ones drop from enemies high level Xmas enemies and they're all on different platforms and you've got to collect as many as you can and deposit the value of 100 into this specific place and you get I think four minutes or ish to do it Titania is the most sensible option for this test unless you are amazing at parkouring or you have another warframe that can sort of spend a lot of time in the air i mean you might just be the most amazing parkourist ever go for it fill your boots i can't do that i'll just fall off the edge because i'll panic uh these aren't really important we just want her to survive and be able to fly around for as long as possible that's all and i've put in her dexia pixie prime this is the main weapon i'm going to be using uh this is the loadout i've got for this i, I can't do much with it it's more of a status machine <laughs> pistol um than crit however it worked a bit slowly the fire rate has come down but it's killing the stuff and the things as quickly as i want it to and i haven't got time really to form it up again it worked in the practice so i'm going to go and do the test guys i'm gonna get on with it so you'll see lots of flying around collect the orbs about 50 at a time ish it all depends how it goes um so yeah let's begin our mastery rank 27 test i'm probably going to shut up so i can concentrate okay demonstrate as per usual efficiency mm -hmm. kill and scavenge for beacons and then quickly deliver them to the drop off to earn the points needed to complete this test they're very pale blue, as you can see. Um, and you can collect them through the bottom of the floor. I mean, they are there. You just can't see them very well. <laughs> so. And there are these big glowing ones, these big orangey red ones. And it's telling me how many points I've got at the top of the screen there. So I'm just keeping an eye on it. I, just, I do want it to get as high as possible. Oh. Did my razor flies kill some of those enemies? Ooh. So you can see my gun is a bit slow, but it does all the jobsicles. Kind of want to keep away from these guys, these Eximuses. Is there a second one there? Oh. Right, we are close to the sweet spot so let's go on back seas i have to pop out of my ability to bank the points and then it resets these ones 
Nice. You'll notice that I'm not speedy gonzalying around because I don't want to lose control. I don't want to smash into anything. I don't want to accidentally smash into the enemies. I'm kind of being ginger about that so I don't go flying because if I lose control and they shoot me down, I lose and drop all of my points and I have to start my little collection again. Which is fine, but it's not fine, do you know what I'm saying? You can shoot them from a distance, so go for it. Upsies. Don't forget to go upsies, it's so easy to forget. These are higher, so if you were parkouring around, obviously it would be a little bit trickier, wouldn't it? Let's face it. Um, is that one over there? Yeah. Are we close to finishing? What have I got for? I need another two. Ah, here we go. These will do. Very tempted to zoom around, but I've got plenty of time. Um, let's not risk that for a biscuit. Let's not die right at the final second. And there you go. It wasn't too stressful, right? Just a nice a fly around. <laughs> this test is now complete. If I'd have had to do that parkouring, I would have stuffed that up so badly. I know there's probably people people out there on the internet that have done it. The parkour version. Good on them. Good on them. Anyway, we are unbelievably now a Mastery 27. <laughs> We're just racing through them now. And um, I'm literally doing them one day after another after another. How I do the videos and release them, I don't know. Because, you know, I was planning on making this last until like March or April. But here we are. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, let me know how you got on with your Mastery Rank 27, who you used. I'm pretty sure Titania would be the most obvious solution. But if you are a freaking parkour master, or if there's another Warframe like... Zephyr can hover, can't she? It's just, you know, it's how much control and speed you've got. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you did. I'm sure there are people that just leapt around like it ain't no ting. And um, I was just gingerly. I mean, I didn't zoom around at all and I still had two odd minutes. So it took me half the time, essentially. So um, very doable. So we've got our normal um, upgrade. Our daily standing limit has gone up. Our daily focus limit has gone up. One base more capacity plus one. Fifty void tray storage has gone up again so that's useful and we are a gold sage mastery rank 27 nice so i suppose i better get rid of this hadn't i really i've got two of them oh i've got two of each that's a dorbs ball so the ones where i've got oh they let me keep it they let me keep my legendary one oh <laughs> i feel emotion thank you devs for letting me keep my legendary one mastery slate from my first go my 28 and that's my 29 i wonder where my 30 is then cool love it i'm here for it guys i just want to thank you so much for watching this very small episode i just thought i'd keep these ones quick and to the point if you guys are trying to figure out how to do it or the best way to do it i mean you just gotta fly around and catch the balls man and deposit them and just chill out calm down it's fine you know plenty of time if you've got a titania you're good anyway guys i just want to thank you so much for watching i really do hope to see you again in the next one whatever that may be but for now you take care and Yes, cat. Oh my god, my cat's having a spaz. <laughs> oh, he's playing. My cat's playing. Anyway, from me and my crazy cat, goodbye. <laughs> this is like my actual real life. It's just chaos. Look at it. Woo! Are you having all the fun, Moose? That's actually really adorable. <laughs>